Hi guys, my name is Ferdy Korpshoek and in this video I want to show you how you can transfer all your incoming and outgoing emails from one email account to a different account. So if I go to my email account on Macmill, I have my account info at Ferdy Corp Media and I want to transfer my whole website Ferdy Corp Media to SiteGround. So what I want to do first, I want to make a backup of this complete inbox and my outbox of info at Ferdy Corp Media. So if you are using Mac Mail or Microsoft Outlook, there should be also a place to do that. I do a right click on my email box and I say export mailbox. I create a new folder. It's called info Ferdy Corp Media. And I choose it. Now it will create a backup. The same goes for the outbox. Right mouse click, export mailbox. And I choose it. And all those emails from my outbox and from my inbox will be saved in that email box I just exported. So I want all those emails and all those outgoing emails in a new account on SiteGround. So I will create a new email address at SiteGround. I go to SiteGround, to the cPanel, and I go to email accounts. I click on it and I create a new one. I say new at Ferdy Corpsuk. I create a new password, repeat it. Mailbox quota, I make it a thousand megabytes and I create an account. And here it is. Now I can check my mail going to access web mail over here. And I see it's completely empty. If I create a new email, I can say new at 30 corpushook.com test from web mail. I send it. Yes. And here it is in my inbox, but also in my outbox. Now I go to Mac mail and I want to create a new account. I go to mail accounts and I click on add other account and mail account. I call this new in capitals and I say new at 30 corpushookcom with my password. I just created sign in. Now I need to get more information. So I go to my cPanel again and I click on more, configure email client. I scroll down and here it says incoming server. I need to fill in this information. It's the same as the outgoing, so I can paste it twice. So I paste it over here and over here. Username, I would begin with copying my email address and I sign in. And if I'm correct, I will see that email I just sent and just received through webmail. I only want to sync my emails, no notes, so I uncheck it and I say done. I close this and what do you see? Over here I have my email test from webmail and I also have received now on my computer. The nice thing is if you use IMAP and I check this email and I mark it and I go to my webmail, it will also be marked my webmail. Now it's red because it's marked. And if I unmark it, unflag it, it will also be unflagged here. So that's great. Now what do I want to do? I go to Ferdicorp Media, I select all the emails and I simply drag them into my new account over here. The same goes for outgoing. So Ferdicorp Media, I select all those emails and I drag them in my new folder. Maybe you think I don't know how my folder is called. I want to rename it Then go to mail accounts, search for the right one, new at Freddy Corpus Hook and call it new. Close it. And now you see clearly it's called new. And what I did, all the emails from info at Freddy Corp Media, I dragged them into this place. So there they are all on the same date. So that's great. So you can transfer big email accounts from one account to a different account without losing the date, without losing emails. So that's great. If you want to transfer your website to a different web hoster, but you want to keep the same email address, then I would use the backup. What I did, I made a backup of my old email address info at ferdicorp.com and I can click on file import mailboxes, Apple mail, continue. 
you can go to your inbox or your outbox you can choose it say done and now here it is and you see all your sent emails from your backup and then you still can drag them when your new account is ready with your new email address so that's how it works if you have any question please leave a comment and if you want to like this video please like it subscribe for more upcoming videos and then you will see me next time bye bye